Hey guys, how's it going? It's a nice cold day here in Birmingham. Uh, I wanted to show you guys this uh, hybrid machete that I've just kind of uh, configured. And uh, so I bought the Gerber uh, Gator machete and I bought the Tramontina machete. They're both about $20 machetes. And I didn't like parts of either one of them but so everybody in the reviews said that the blade on the Tramontina is really great and everybody on the Gerber reviews said that the handle on the Gerber was really great so I decided to put the handle on the Tramontina also the sheath of the Gerber is really nice uh, but the Tramontina blade has a full-length tang so the tang comes all the way down to here now and all I had to do really was kind of widen the holes on the tang a little and also drill some new holes in this handle and then I had to angle grind kind of a slit down the length of the handle to fit the blade in there. And then I just used some hex head hardware in there and kind of tightened it until it was flush and then ground off the excess on the bolt side. And I used one of the stock holes here in stock hardware there. Uh, but it cuts really well, it feels really nice. You know, everybody said the Tramontina, the handle is too short and it's, you know, it's wood, it'll eat up your hands, it's not comfortable to use all day. But now this one, I think you could use this for just about anything. It's great for survival. I've actually, with survival in mind, I added a little fire starter uh, magnesium and flint rod here so that they're always together. You can cut firewood, start a fire, build a shelter with this. Uh, you know, self-defense against like maybe bears or lions or whatever, at least you'll have a chance as opposed to trying to fight them with your hands or, you know, if you find yourself out in the wilderness. All in all, it took me about two, two or three hours to get this handle switched over. And, you know, I just love the way it feels. It's a little longer. It fits in the sheath really nice light enough that I think you could carry it around all day and not get tired of it. Yeah, I just wanted to show you guys that. I thought, you know, this kind of combines the best of both of the cheapest machetes that you can get, and it's super cheap, and I bet it'll stand up there uh, with some of the best that are out there. You know, there's a really strong blade, now the handle is very strong, it's very comfortable, has a lot of grip. So yeah, uh, if you feel like having a project, maybe you try this out, build one for yourself. Uh, I think it's great, I love it. I love cutting stuff with it. I've just been cutting brush around the house all morning. And so yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this and uh, hit the like and subscribe button down below. Leave a comment of your favorite survival item that you own. And I'll see you guys next time. Thank <laughs> you.